so she's not going to go anywhere until uh, you clear the road of stuff. So push all the cars obviously off the way. Um, if you haven't noticed as you've been playing, if you uh, shot gas stations, they cause gigantic explosions and cause fire damage near everything that's around it. Um, unfortunately, and I don't know if I mentioned this, but a really dumb thing about this mission is uh, the truck won't go anywhere unless you're on top of it, which is kind of retarded because, uh, I don't know, there should have been a way that you could signal the truck to stop and go. Because otherwise, you know, I don't know, it's just frustrating that the truck is just simply a sitting duck while you got the attention of everybody fighting you. The truck could just easily sneak past. Or attempt to, but I can also see how that would have become a bother if you had to keep up the truck's pace. But at least it would have meant that this mission would have had a timer on it since, you know, there's only so long it would take for a moving target to get from point A to point B. Here's the last stretch of it. So, what I did here was just as the bus turned the corner, jump out. First thing you should do or focus on is taking out the enemies within the immediate vicinity and then clear the road, then take out the rest of the enemies. But be sure not to get overwhelmed or flanked because they will do so and they won't even care. Ooh, I took it bad. And also, um, I think I had to edit out a death because as I pushed one of the cars out of the way, um, something happened, the car exploded, it rebounded off a building and then came back and crushed me to death, which is awesome, but a little frustrating, to say the least. Now this is the last leg of the mission just about before your... yeah. Yeah, the last leg of it. Ooh, wow. We got nailed that rocket. They're just blowing me all over the place. Flip ending. 
Um, you gotta hurry up and get Slap Bus or it's gonna tip over and Trish is gonna die. So what I did is I just hurried around, went to the left side, ignored all the enemies, and then just went to the blind side where all the enemies aren't and just start scaling the building as fast as I could. Which isn't bad. They give you a pretty lenient time limit, but getting to the actual bus is pretty rough, but uh, this, this, this wasn't so bad. Since I just fly over and then just make my way to the bus. So I actually went to the opposite building that they aren't guarding and then just scurried over to this building, which where these guys are. Make sure you don't kill Trish on accident. And that's that. You alright? Yeah, I think so. I was really worried there, Trish. Nothing ever happened to you. I, I don't know what I'd do. If you really cared about me, you wouldn't be running around attacking innocent people destroying what little they have left. You know, it's like you're purposely trying to undo all the work I've done. But what really upsets me is that it didn't have to be this way. You brought this on yourself. You can sleep downstairs if you want. Just stay away from me. Tracking a couple developments, Cole. There are rumors that a large-scale conflict might erupt between the cops and the Warren and the Dustmen. Look into it. Moya, you've got to get me the hell out of here. I don't care what it takes. No one's going anywhere until I have the Ray Sphere and John is safe. You know that. Yeah, Trish thinks you're a douche. And you just got...